What's going on, everybody? It's D. Frank, and you're back in the domain. And as you see off screen, I've drove, driven over to the mainland, and this idiot in the land stalker just drove clean into me with no rhyme or reason. But, anyways, we're gonna um, get down to um, the next set of missions. Uh, we're gonna go back to the um, mainland. This is downtown. I apologize for that error. We're going to go and do those missions for Colonel Cortez and get it finished up. And right now I'm about to go up in here and change some clothes real quick. Yo, Tommy, it's Lance. Yeah. Oh, nice to hear from you, Lance. Come on, man. Be cool. Be cool. I'm in the middle of something. What do you want? Nothing. Just to say, you know, look, Tommy, we can do this thing. You and me, no problem. You know what I mean? We're going to have to do it. Because otherwise, we're going to be dead, Lance. We're in too far now. But thanks for the call. I'll speak to you later. Yeah, Lance. I was in the middle of talking to these people that's watching this video, man. Rude asshole. <laughs> Let me stop. But no, um, I do need to grab some armor. I think it's some on top of the print works. So yeah, we're gonna go over and I'm gonna grab the armor and then we're gonna start finishing up the Colonel Cortez mission. I wanna say the next mission up is uh Sir Yes Sir. And Ooh, Tommy falling down the stairs. And you know what guys, I think I will just get back with you once uh I make it over there to the mainland to uh, to uh, start the mission. All right, guys, we have made it to the boat yard. Well, this ain't the boat yard, but where Colonel Cortez's yacht is located, and we're about to get to the next mission. Yes, was pleased. I would like to meet you again. Is that a good thing? Of course, although I'm starting to think that Diaz was responsible for our unfortunate loss. What makes you say that? One does not wave accusations at a man like Diaz. I'm merely thinking out loud, no matter. I have a proposal that you could profit. I don't have time to run more errands, Cortez. I would have thought a man with such dangerous dates would be hungry for opportunities. Please, Tommy, at least hear me out. Go on. I have a buyer for a piece of military hardware that is being taken through town. Pick it up for me. And once you get it, I want you to call me immediately. Then... All right, we're going to go right back across the bridge. Um, wait a minute. This is where I wanted to say a PCJ spawn right down there. Hey guys, uh, I'm over here thinking about it. Let me turn off that siren. I just wanted to, I just wanted to point something out. The first time I ever got in this police cheetah, I noticed that it had three side view mirrors, and I wanted to make sure that the cheetahs and you know the regular civilian cheetahs wasn't like that. I don't know if that's a glitch or what, but yeah, that's that's weird, but I think I want to wreak wreak havoc, wreak havoc over the streets of Vice City on a bike. So we're gonna go back across the bridge and wait for the convoy. So yeah, how you guys' days been going, man? Um, it's been it's been going on my end. Been kind of kind of busy with things. Um, 
at the time I'm recording this is November 17th. Uh, just came off of a you know long weekend last weekend. Um, had a funeral for one of my aunts, and it was good to be around family for a little bit, even though it's kind of bad when it's you know it comes to those type of things. But you know that's life. And then today, pretty sure you guys may have. Uh, heard the news about Young Dolph the rapper and that unfortunate situation but as of right now we're gonna put pause on the uh, chit chat and this is what Colonel Cortez was talking about a tank and how many of you guys back in the day would just straight up just assault the uh, convoy and just try to take strong on the tank. I know as a teenager, I just went in gun, all gun blazing like I was in some kind of western and just went and did it and I think I uh, got shot up pretty, pretty, pretty quick and yeah, it wasn't fun. So this is what I'm about to do. And I like the texturing and detail on the tanks in this game, but I hate that they included that rotating camera where you can't manually rotate the turret for the tanks like they did. I think San Andreas was the first game that introduced that. If, of all the things to change, that should have been one of the things they left, left along with GTA 3 and Vice City. Leave the leave the tank controls with the turrets alone. Leave it manual. But that's the easiest way to do it because, like I was saying, as a kid, I used to just go in gun ho, all guns blazing, and then got shot up after acquiring the tank. So, so yeah, um, we didn't pass the mission. So I'm trying to see if we get another phone call. I think we do, but I'm just waiting. There we go. Right, I'm mm -hmm. oh, I might have a little result for you, but I need to speak to you in person. I'm enjoying a little R&R &R at the Club Malibu. I reckon you're going to owe me a favor or two after this sunshine. I'll see you later. Well, I think we all know where this is going. Um, yep, I already know where this is going. If I don't get a call from Colonel Cortez, uh, I'm gonna just get on the line with uh, I'm gonna just get on the line with Ken Paul and go to the um, whoa, job man, hell no, this must be another collision glitch or error or some like, and what are these big old barricades even in the uh, original Vice City, anyways. That just took me off, threw me off a little bit. But um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go tackle the next Ken Paul mission. I mean, uh, not the next. Well, we're gonna tackle this Ken Paul mission, and it's gonna lead to a very crucial turning point in the game. I'm gonna let Tommy catch his breath. And the Cuban car just didn't care how he just came across there like that so you know what there we go bike perfect oh god dang what the oh crap just i'm just over here rambling well you guys i'll tell you what i'm done rambling i'll just get back to you guys once I make it to just fine. once I make it to um, Malibu
right, Mus. I'm going to save your Vera, mate. What the hell are you talking about? You know that wanker Diaz, the Bugelmeister? He's got your boy Lance. Word is, you might try to jump. You didn't jump high enough, if you know what I mean. Where did he take him? Ah! ah. Oh, hey, all right, plain mate. English. Keep your party on. You got him across town the junkyard. Bloody hell, you nutter! Tommy just got straight to the point. Let's get up in this car and go to straight to the junkyard. That's exactly how I feel. It's about to get real. Let's get on over here to the junkyard, y'all. And it's pretty imperative to have a car that's pretty fast because if you're not careful, Lance's health will just plummet and he could die and I'm surprised his health is not really going down right now um that's I don't know if they nerfed that in this game or not but it's kind of weird but anyways made it over here to little Haiti right now not too far from the junkyard uh I'm not even really looking at the nav you know the GPS on here to really see where I'm at Ah, damn. Would you lock onto a target? Okay, Lance's health is starting to decline now. Uh, this is one of the missions where you don't get a cash reward. So, if you can, try to collect as much cash as you can while these idiots drop it. Trash truck. Trying to find all these, trying to find all these dudes. Lance's health is starting to, starting to dwindle now. You know what this is? Be careful not to shoot Lance when you're up in there. And yeah, Lansing's not done yet, so I'm just getting a little bit of, little bit of this cash. Those guys aren't gonna need it anymore. Come on! There goes my careful planning, blown to shit. Thanks to you, you screwed up real good, Lance. He killed my brother. What do you expect me to do, mow his lawns? We're gonna have to take out that prick Diaz before he takes us out. You okay to use a gun? Sure, I guess. Nice to see you too. Let's get out of here. Alrighty, we're gonna get in that Sentinel that was parked right out here. Uh, I don't know why the game just didn't recognize when I was literally standing, standing right there by Lance to um, just get up in up you, you know to trigger the cutscene, but it is what it is. Squishing all these guys. And here comes Diaz's men. They're driving around. They're driving around in these comments, so there's me. Shit. What the hell? What the fuck? Man, what the hell is going on? Come here. Ugh, God damn it. Tom, I don't go. Tom, I don't go so low. You gotta be kidding me! Hey, who are you? Fuck it. 
First time I've ever seen this adrenaline pill right here, so we're about to We're about to do something. We're about to uh, come on. Uh, aim at this dude. Um, I'm gonna get Lance to the hospital if I can get in a get in the car. You gotta be kidding me! This is worth the price. You gotta. You gotta be kidding me! Come on! You gotta be kidding me, man. You gotta be kidding me. I get Lance to the Lance to the hospital, man. Y'all better not pull that crap on me again. I was driving over there getting them towards the hospital. Y'all ain't hitting me with the open dope twice. Y'all ain't getting me with that one twice. That's the first time I've ever played this mission and I failed it like that. That was just ridiculous. You know what I'm tempted to do? You know what I'm tempted to do? I'm not even gonna. Y'all will just see. Y'all will see what I'm. Y'all gonna see what I'm gonna end up doing. And it seems like Lance's health is going down faster now for some reason. So this time I'm not gonna. Don't make me use this. This time I'm not gonna play around with him. I'm gonna just get it. I'm gonna just get it done this time. Shit! I did not try to do that because. Wait, I didn't know it was a dude up in, up in the damn trash truck. Yeah, I did not know it was a dude up in the trash truck. I remember playing this one time back in the day. Um, it was a dude that, you know, it glitched out one time. I had killed the dude over there took his money and it just stayed stuck to the ground. Another head. I need the money. Come on. There goes my careful planning blow of shit. Thanks to you. You screwed up real good, Lance. He killed my brother. What do you expect me to do? Mow his lawns? Gonna have to take out that prick Come on. Diaz before he takes us out. Come on. You okay to use a gun? Sure. I guess. Nice to see you too. Let's get out of here. Get in the trash truck. Get in the trash truck. Get in, Lance. Okay, the tire's still flat, but this time around my plan is gonna be I'm gonna drive this trash truck. Try to see them bully me in this trash truck. Cause that was some BS that last time, man. That was old. Yeah, that was some old BS last time. Anybody get me like that twice? I hate I shot the dog on tire out on this thing, but we here now. And I don't understand how they're getting outran by a trash truck. 
Oh, never mind. I take that back. He's literally right on my tail with the trash truck. I mean, in that comet. I thought the game was about to freeze up or glitch out or something right then and there. Oh boy, this has been... My gameplay as of lately has been very sloppy. It's been reflective of a little bit of like my last couple days or whatnot. Shoot, it's been it's been kind of rough, but we'll make it through. We'll make it through. Get patched up and meet me on the bridge to Star Island. Okay? Okay, I got you. I just like how GTA logic after you pass the mission. Now uh, after you get to the. Uh, After you get to whatever checkpoint it is, it just send the guys, just tell the guys to back off. Just tell the guys to back off and you pass the mission. Like, that always blows my mind. I'm about to get rid of Diaz. Ain't nobody calling the cops. I'm finishing off all of, since Diaz wanted to put the hit out, I'm finishing off all these guys and taking their money. They gonna pay me. So with all the craziness that's been going on, I think we made a little over over two grand picking up all the money off of those guys. So what we're gonna do is buy one of the coolest properties in the game. Well, we're gonna answer the phone first. All right, we're gonna finish the last Colonel Cortez mission, and then the next mission we will do um, the the Rub Diaz mission, Rub out Diaz in the next mission. So we're gonna purchase the the condo, and then I'm gonna go get get, get some more armor and probably change out some of my weapons, and then we're gonna go go see Colonel Cortez. Has anybody noticed in the games where whenever a garage opens, it just, just, that sound just loops? It doesn't, uh, it just doesn't sound like it's fluent. It sounds like something is wrong with the sound animation for garage doors opening. Maybe that's just me. I, I don't know. So, yeah, I think I'm going to go by Amnu Nation. And then I'm gonna pull up on Colonel Cortez and we're gonna finish that out. Hopefully it, we don't have any funky, weird controls that cause us to glitch out and we have to do it, do it repeat the mission. MP5. Man, all the, all the cool weapons out of stock, the stuff that I actually want. The stuff that I actually wanted to get, but it is what it is. The next time we talk, we'll be. Why you hate women so much? Yeah, the next time we talk, you guys, I will be uh, doing Colonel Cortez's mission. And I just don't understand why it takes so long for Tommy to just get up on the bike. Or uh, what, whatever vehicle it is, once you're trying to steal it, it seems like he hesitates. Like I just pressed triangle there, and it seemed like it took him a took him a second to get up on it. But anyways, we're heading on over to Cortez for real this time. And I All right, guys, we are at Colonel, Colonel Cortez's, and we're about to do his last mission. Circumstances force a hasty departure. 
What's the problem? Ah, uh, the French want their missile technology back, and after that last incident, I feel it is time to find safer hoppers. Wouldn't it be safer to fly? I'd be dead before I reach check-in. Besides, I need to get my merchandise out of the country. Need another gun? You, my friend, are worth ten guns. <laughs> Colonel Cortez with that hearty laugh. Here comes the French. Wait a minute. They just give you a random Cortana in, in this game, in this mission, I'm guessing. So. I didn't even know that this mission replenished my armor at the beginning. But I'm not complaining. Zero thirty. You know what? Come on. I just know y'all seen how I was trying to aim at them and it didn't want to originally lock on to these dudes. Didn't they have a? Well, at least he took that dude out. I was just gonna wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm just all over the place. Then in the original, they have an a. Then they have an Apache helicopter that was called the Hunter to attack the boat. Maybe am I missing something? Other than this big boat, uh, helicopter just sitting on the deck of this big boat. Oh, okay. I wasn't crazy. There go that hunter right there. Hopefully, I got enough bullets. Ah, damn. This camera need to get get in a position to where I can see what's going on. Oh. There we go. Why isn't this helicopter charred? Like, damn thing literally just, ex well, it's off in the water now. I was going to say, damn thing literally exploded and was on fire. But, oh well. Look like this mission is passed. Tomas, you have protected and served me well. But now you must leave us before we reach the open seas. I will lower my personal launch. Keep it, my friend. 
A token of my gratitude. Thank you, Kern. Uh, one more request. While I'm away, could you keep an eye on Mercedes for me? I think she could look after herself, but sure, I'll keep an eye out. Gracias, amigo. Hasta luego. Adios, amigo.